Whoever said you can't get a hangover from good scotch did not adequately research the subject. Oh. I take it you made some new friends. I was the toast of the town and the bane of their expense accounts. So, tell me. It's really quite simple. The big multinationals, the brokers, the middlemen, they don't give a continental who runs Abiyomi or how it's run. Look, if the devil himself were drilling for oil on the Delta and using Adolf Hitler, Pol Pot and Idi Amin as his marketing men, they still wouldn't hesitate to transfer the money into his account. And the deaths in the Delta? The bloodshed, the corruption. Come on. These are the new colonials, my friend. It's all just about the business. Profit is how they keep score, and dirty deeds is how they get their jollies. We're gonna have to clean it up. No one will thank you. The people will. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Lerato Makubo. Welcome to my show. My very first show, and probably the most important show I'll ever make. Strange how out of despair new and positive things are born. My family and I were recently victims of a terrible crime. We're trying to rebuild and find our feet again. I asked you all here today because I want to talk about our family, our future. But most of all, I want to talk about our people and the injustice that's committed against them in our name by one of our own. But this is not about me. This is not about what happened to my family, to my son. Our story made the news. Our story had a happy ending. My show is about those stories that don't make the news, that don't get people talking, and that so very often don't have a happy ending. The world can be a tough enough place without any effort on our part. Too many people are hungry. Too many people have no work, no homes, no future. And yet we add to that very load with the terrible things that we do to each other. All in pursuit of what? A little more money. A little more power. One more moment of pleasure. For that, we rape and steal and beat and kill. We all know what Bola is. We all know what he's done. And everyone has been willing to sit on the side and let him do as he pleases, hoping that he'll leave you alone. Through our inaction, we all have blood on our hands. Me too. What about the price we pay to our society, to the economy? But before we make this about money and miss the real story, let's look at the real cost. The traumatized victims, families torn apart, children unable to sleep in their own beds, the dead, and those who have to bury them. And so today I come here to ask for your support as I seek to fix things, to make it right. I ask for your support as I seek to rid this family of the rot that is creeping through our core. I can't promise that it's going to be easy, but I can promise you this. When I'm finished, you will be able to hold your heads up high and with pride say, as you used to say in the time of my father, I am an Abayomi. In a world full of talk about EQ and a better life for all, what legacy are we leaving our children? 